We're at a coin store where we're gonna recreate a theft scenario so you can see the detail. So what we did is we took an IP camera and an analog camera, put them on a level playing field, and we're gonna record the exact same image so you can see the difference between analog and IP. Let's take a look. Okay, here we have side-by-side -side comparison with undoctored video of both analog and IP footage at their native resolution. Both are good for general observation. But when we take the analog image up to 200%, we see that the image starts to pixelate, whereas the detail in the IP camera is still larger and more clear. Now, when we go up to 300%, we really start to see the difference. Whereas the subject is close to the same size in both images, the IP delivers much more clear detail. But what if you really want to zoom in to see this guy? When we blow up both images, the analog on the left and the IP on the right, you start to see where those extra dollars are spent. IP gives you a much clearer image, where it's a little bit grainy on the analog. You can see him putting coins in his pocket. You can tell he has a watch. You can tell he has a good looking pen in his pocket. These are the type of details you're going to get with IP, and that's why it's a few dollars more.